Swift UI, a modern declarative UI framework from Apple. Announced in the summer of 2019, Swift UI promised a one size fits all UI creation future. That is, if your future only consists of Apple platforms. Build experiences for iOS, macOS, and watchOS. You can get started in Apple's IDE Xcode. Create a new project and select SwiftUI as your interface option. You'll be greeted with view code to the left and a flaky live preview to the right. As you build, in theory, you should see all of your live UI updates in the preview. In practice, the live preview is quite moody and won't work 47% of the time. Create components with concise syntax. Stylize them with modifiers like foreground color, corner radius, font, and tons more. Arrange UI elements vertically, horizontally, or on top of one another with creatively named stacking groups. Bind your UI elements with interactions and data through states, bindings, and observable objects. Never miss an edge case again using the declarative approach SwiftUI offers. The framework intelligently rebuilds targeted parts of your view as data changes, ending your need to call reload or update view once and for all. But if you're practical like me, not to worry. SwiftUI can play nice with Apple's existing UI framework, UIKit. Use UI View Representable or UI View Controller Representable to shove UIKit views into SwiftUI-like objects. Once done building, you can deploy your app on all of Apple platforms. This will undoubtedly future-proof your app to run on the highly anticipated Apple Toaster. Show off your latest UI creation to all of your friends while they wait on their toast. And with that, this has been SwiftUI in 100 seconds. Don't forget to like and subscribe for future videos.